Good morning, everybody. <laughs> Gabriel's asleep. <laughs> We're gonna be spending some time in Rockwall, Texas today. Checking out whatever there is to see in Rockwall. We have no idea. So, come on. Anything to say to the people? So tired. Sarah's tired. All right, let's go. Gabriel's making friends at restaurants. On the move. Now we're checking out the downtown of this rock wall area. See what it's all about. We just finished hipster breakfast. <laughs> it was very hipster breakfast. <laughs> it was good, but it was hipster. <laughs> Quick update, nothing is open. So we will not be exploring the charming downtown rock wall. And it's cold, so let's go back to the car. Hold on, getting some video of charming downtown rock wall. <laughs> so that's what happens when you get somewhere really early. Because we're here, it looks like 9 o'clock in the morning, so none of these little small businesses are open yet. And they look super cute, and I'm disappointed. <laughs> Gabriel, what are your thoughts? A That's a terrible out. angle. <laughs> really washed out, too. Anyway, now we're headed to, I think we're going to head to what I'm excited about. We're going to see a spaceship. Check it out. It's a spaceship. <laughs> Sarah did not want to get out. I don't blame her. Better than graffiti. So this is actually an Italian, I think, it's an Italian uh, portable ski chalet. That's what the original design was supposed to be. And there are only a handful of them in the country. And it's kind of a thing to go and find. It's called the Fu Futuro House. We had to let Gabriel get out and go look at it. He's upset about that. So anyway, that's the Futuro house. It's a spaceship out in the middle of uh, nowhere, Texas. <laughs> All right, we're headed back. All right, we're back in our neck of the woods in the uh, Irving, Texas area, and we're about to go what, you had something to say? Yeah, say this it. is our old stomping grounds. We used to live in an apartment over here. We really liked it. And of course, as soon as we move out, they build the whole area up and add a bunch of cool things. Yeah, kind of hate driving back through here because every time we drive through here, I'm like, oh man. Yeah, some really cool stuff. So, but we are at the Mustangs of Las Colinas. I think it has an official title. I think it's called the Mustangs. No, I think it's a, we're gonna find out because there's signs. Because I've read all about it. I don't remember, but I think it's called something. These are some iconic statues of Mustangs. Run through some water right here in Williams Square. So it's pretty cool. Here you go. This is to give you an idea of the scale. 
of the Mustangs. What do you think about the Mustangs? <laughs> you want to ride one? It's against the rules, but I'll let you. There's a little one just for you. <laughs> so, y'all see that super tall building right behind us? When we first moved here, we lived in an apartment right across the highway on the other side. You can see it from our, uh, our balcony. First moved here I always said I really one day I want to go to the top of that thing I want to see what's on the top floor because it looks kind of like I mean it looks pretty cool so my wife being exponentially cooler than I am you gonna let me tell a story <laughs> has been up there several times tell the story it's an executive dinner club and so I've had a couple of meetings with my physicians and whatnot up there you turn the camera off I'm talking Golly. I gave a snooty look so we can come back, tell us the rest of the story. So anyway, she's so much cooler than I am. I don't get to talk she's, on camera. Because she's already, because she's been up there like a bunch of times. The view is really cool. I have yet to go up there. <laughs> I'm hoping that one day I can leverage the baby because all of her coworkers love seeing the baby. So one day when she's having one of those meetings, I could just like bring the baby so that they could see the baby. And I'll hand the baby off and then go look around. I'll be sure to film the whole thing so everybody gets to see. For a dreary start to the day, it is now beautiful. Gabriel woke up from a two hour nap. So we're going to take him to the park, see if we can wear him out a little bit more. He's got his milk, he's ready to go. Can't tell if you see him there if I'm filming it or not, but he just put his milk in the cup holder. Because <laughs> he's the smartest boy ever. lap around you? Yep. Nope. I'm making a break for the pond. Here I go. Uh -oh.
Weekend adventures are back. All the holidays are behind us. We can get out again. <laughs> anyway. Thank you for watching Thank you all video. for watching. <laughs> Subscribe to our channel to see more. Be sure to uh, leave us a comment. Let us know what you think. Give it a the... like if you enjoyed it. Yep. If you've ever been to any of the other flying saucers around the country or if you've ever been to Irving and seen the Mustangs, let us know. So be sure to give us a like. Thank you all for watching, and we'll see you guys later. Say bye, Gabriel. He said, where'd the camera go? Say bye, Gabriel. Thank you all for watching. Bye.